this is the CCAC Homewood Brushton Center's Verizon Community Forward Adult Learning Center. We focus on technology and community awareness of digital literacy. That's Dr. Jules Smith, the executive director of the center. Created by Verizon in partnership with Neighborhood Allies, the center is going full steam ahead, ushering everyone who chooses to take the ride into the digital age. We have a lecture space as well as a lab-based space where students can learn hands-on experiences with some of our trades, as well as the use of 3D printers, laser cutters, etc. Students can also earn credits for degrees or certificates in areas like entrepreneurship, computer specialist, network specialist, or cybersecurity. Teaching today's class on the internal workings of their computer hardware was Belita McIntosh, who supports Dr. Smith at the center. Like their varied course offerings, their classrooms welcome a diverse student body spanning different educational stages, including undergraduates, professionals, and even retirees. And then we also have some students that just want to learn. They just, it makes them excited to learn. Tara Wright, who already holds a bachelor's in engineering, is expanding her computer skills through a class on Excel spreadsheets for business environments. Applications are kind of being updated every year. It's like you're learning about new things. I'm, as I sit in class, my teacher is telling me the different things she uses it for, and I'm like, oh, no, I never considered that. I never. So just learning new ways to kind of use these programs that I thought I was familiar with. It is imperative for people in today's society where so many things function based on technology, as well as staying ahead of the game for career advancements, uh, with Pittsburgh changing over, and we have all of these different research facilities opening. We have Google, who has been magnificent, Duolingo, et cetera, being more marketable for the workforce. You know, we're in the digital age where kind of, if you don't know technology, you're kind of going to be on the outskirts of society, not going to know what's going on. So I think it's a great opportunity just to kind of broaden the exclusivity of the field and, you know, just get people familiar with the different possibilities in the industry. Rodney Smith Sr., a retired Pennsylvania State Trooper, has not retired from learning, but is embracing technology, even if it's just to keep up with his grandkids. Before I retired, basically there were desktops. We had just come up to the computer age. But now since I've been retired and I'm dealing more with computers, even with my grandkids, I'm trying to get a little knowledge and, you know, just to even deal with them because they, they're they pretty well versed with dealing with iPads and phones and all. We are here to close that gap and allow people to feel empowered, allow people to feel that they have a place in community and not just get lost in all the things that are developing. Not only is the center propelling students into the digital age, but they are providing a vibrant hub for community growth and empowerment. It's just the in-class experience with other individuals. They're also learning and we're just sharing, you know, ideas and where we come and where we're going. So yeah, it's just been a great experience. This is where the community is in the community. CCAC is a community within itself because we're spread out in so many different areas, but we have amazing faculty and staff, and us together are now able to better serve the community of Homewood, Brushton, and Abide.